Hey guys, so I am getting ready to take a little nap. Pretty sure that um, Phoebe's going to be having puppies soon today. Hopefully, maybe, hopefully today and not tonight or early tomorrow morning. But uh, Emmy's watching the baby so I can take a little nap. I'm usually the one that stays up with them all throughout the night. So um, I want to get a little bit of rest before that happens. <laughs> on your tacos. I'm like plain Jane. Refried beans, cheese, meat, and sour cream. And it likes lettuce. Ugh. And salsa. Ugh. Right? I like tortilla chips. No lettuce, no salsa, no tomatoes. You put tortilla chips on your tacos? Before I put lettuce, yes. What are you doing? You like that toy? What did you put on your tacos? Yeah, what do you put on your tacos? Formula? Pureed apples? What about you, Flynn? Meat? Yeah? Lettuce? Yeah? Tomatoes? Clementines? Clementines! Phoebe <laughs> loves Clementines. <laughs> hey guys, so Phoebe has not had puppies yet. Um, I thought maybe she was going to tonight, but she faked us out. So. I thought a fun thing for us to do would be to go through my whelping kit to show you guys everything that I use when we have puppies. So the first thing that we have is lots of towels. I got all these towels from my mom. They're like the like the towels they use at the hospital. For whatever reason, these are just great. They soak up everything that you could need soaked up. So I have a ton of these, a ton, a ton of them. I got I have a whole huge stack of those. Next thing that I have, hand sanitizer, because, well, you want to be sanitary when you're holding newborn puppies. Next thing that we have is, um, these are hemostats. They are to clamp the um, puppy's umbilical cords off to stop the bleeding. Some puppies, you don't even have to really do this, and others, you have to really hold it on there for a little while. It just depends. Some puppies are bleeders and some aren't. Um, I have some medical scissors for cutting cords, baby wipes, these are for me because they're kind of gross and, um, I have a stethoscope, I use this, um, before the puppies are born I use it just to listen, just to make sure that everything sounds okay, that we can hear the heartbeat, um, I use this after they're born so that I can check and see if there's any more puppies inside of her. Sometimes it's not always accurate because they have a hard time like laying still enough because they're just excited and they want to lick their puppies and clean them. So sometimes I have a hard time hearing, but I like to check anyway just to, you know, try and be sure. 
I have um, basically like a KY jelly, lubricating jelly. This is if I ever need to um, try and help get a puppy out or ease a puppy out. This is also for when I take temperatures, um, which is another thing that I don't actually have in my kit right now. There's a thermometer. It's actually over by her box, but I have a thermometer to take temperature. I have a bulb syringe. This is to get anything out of the puppy's lungs, out of their nose. Um, they get a lot of fluid in there. And the last thing that I have is formula in a bottle. Um, just in case, sometimes if the mom's milk doesn't come in, sometimes if there's too many puppies, you know, just basically to have on hand just in case because you never know what's going to happen and, you know, you want to have these things just in case to be prepared. So, um, this is everything I have. Sometimes I also, I also have Tums too. Sometimes when the moms are in labor, you want to give them some calcium just to help you know, move things along. So I have Tums too, although that's not in this kit right at this current moment. But, um, that's everything. So I just thought you guys might want to see what we have, what I use it for. Um, if you guys have any questions about any of that stuff, let me know. Bye, guys.